Could Rosenfeld use Buffett's comments to justify remaining firm in the bid? Yeah, it's interesting in almost all negotiations, you can always say, well, what's another 10 cents or what's another 50 cents? After all, you really want it strategically. You've advanced your strategic theory to the world and it, and, and it makes sense. Um, so what's another couple of, you know, $100 million among friends, so to speak? Well, there are points at which you say, no, that's too much. And that was a signal to, to the arbitrage community that you better be careful about what bets you make. There, there have been, in the past, so-called take-unders, where the market get, got a, way out in, ahead of a uh, tender offer, and people lost money. Part of their idea is, let's say the bid's at 100, well, if we can just push it up to 105, certainly not going to walk away from it for, 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 just because the market's at 105, and how can they buy it if it if their bids at 100 and the stock's trading at 105. Well, in fact, that's happened, and that's the risk you take when you do arbitrage. And I think she was trying to send a signal that don't, don't count on us to do something that, that goes beyond the point.